Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I thought we could do a best and last shot with me. It was requested by one of you guys to see what Christmas goodies they have in store. Also just general kitty stuff I find really really great in the best and last. So let's go and take a look. If you guys enjoyed these videos as always give it a thumbs up. Go down and leave me in the comments your favourite piece that we find today in store and let's get on with it. Got the little cutie pie today. Have a nice. Yeah. One thing I really love about Best and Less is their basics. They're really good quality, but look how cute the quotes are. Not today. And this is only $4. It's the Baby Berry brand. I do find that the Baby Berry brand normally runs a little small, so I always upsize, but otherwise the quality is always really nice and great value for money. I have come across some really beautiful girls' Christmas outfits. I mean, they're not really specific to Christmas. You could wear them year round, but obviously being red, they very much go in the theme of Christmas. First of all, you've got this little romper with a sort of t-shirt attached and it's got this embroidered detailing. That one is $25, very affordable. And they've also got this beautiful romper, which is lace detailed. I love, love, love that one. If I had a little girl, that's what I would get. And that one was only $20, which is a bargain. Then they've got my first Christmas little outfit. Same with this one, it comes with a headband and a little tutu one. Oh, so blooming cute. This is the only time that I really miss having a girl is just to dress them in cute little tutus and things. Oh my goodness, look at the little boys' shirts. Button up stuff, only 10 bucks. Oh my gosh, I love that linen shirt. I need to get that for my boys immediately. I have a real thing for linen this summer. Is cream a bad choice though? They also have it in mustard. Okay, I absolutely love boy clothes too. Look at that. That is adorable. And is that, oh my gosh. Best of us are coming out with good guys. I always underestimate best of us. I always forget about them and then I come in and they've always exceeded my expectations. Look at that. That is adorable. Okay, all right, I need to get seriously shopping now. If you're wanting something for Christmas for your boys that's not necessarily screaming Christmas, but just a bit fancy, they have these gorgeous little sets, which is like, what do you call it? Not corduroy. Uh, it'll come to me when I'm editing, <laughs> I always say that. They're only $35, I remember getting one from Best and Less that had a blue bottoms um, for Darcy's first birthday and I still have them and I love them. They've got the cutest little hats, these little guys being a little bit cranky. Hey, a little bit cranky. Um, and then they've got this really cool sort of tiger jungle design one. Love it. Oh, look at the mustard one. They have adorable Christmas swimsuits. How freaking cute is that? How much is it? $15. Bargain. So they have the really cute Dr. Seuss. Only $16. I'll be good next year pajamas with the cute green bottoms. And then they've got the gingerbread men version as well which is so cute only $12 that one have a little addition so if the camera's wobbling it's because of you yes it is <laughs> they also have this Mickey pajamas which says merry vibes only very cute they have these big sorry I'm wobbling because Winnie's jumping some big onesies which do come in smaller sizes and they're obviously very Christmassy, very retro Christmassy like the games because they're all pixelated. Dabbing through the snow. The Christmas pajama range is really really cute. They've also got some cute little boxes that are really nice and silky and soft and they've got very cute Christmas designs. Oh, I've spotted more girl ones. So here They've got best Christmas ever with the cute little like frilly bottoms. Team Rudolph. They've got all the different um, reindeer on them. Dear Santa, I've been good. T-Rex. Tree Rex? Oh, Christmas Tree Rex. <laughs> so cute. 
moved. Looking through the women's section. They have some cute pieces, but I was going to get some to try on, to do like a try on haul. But to be honest with you, the quality is not as good as I was thinking it might be. Like I know it's a cheap price, um, so you can't expect the world from them, but they're really see-through, the $15 range. Um, and I don't really want to waste my money on stuff that I know I would not wear. He's there. <laughs> He's getting cranky. Um, but I'll show you a few bits that I like um, that you can maybe come try on if you're interested, but I'm definitely not gonna be buying any today. So the first one is this gorgeous dress. It's like a linen-y feel. It's $30 and it has a belt in the middle. I really like that bit. This skirt looks really cute. It's pleated and has like a, not cheetah, or maybe it's a cheetah design, except it's got like a gray with a creamy brown through it. That one is, that one's only $25. I have two beautiful red checker dresses. One's a romper and one is a dress and it's got these gorgeous little buttons down. They're not functional buttons, but still, it's also folded up a little bit, but really cute. So they do Christmas boxes for men for $5. They've got baubles. And then this is my favorite one. It says, bite me. <laughs> it's candy canes and gingerbread men. They've got Santa shorts and some reindeer. These shorts and the women's pajamas are really cute. They're a silk and they've got, as you can see, gingerbread men, candy cane. It's only $5. Really affordable. We've got some present ones, candy cane wishes, mistletoe kisses. They've got some really nice, beautiful, plain ones with the black hearts. And I love the quote on this one back here. It says, I'm only a morning person on December 25th. <laughs> really like that. In the bigger boy section they have some T-Rex Christmas shirts, some little elf ones, Rudolph without a claws. <laughs> For your older boys there's a skull decorated Christmas one which I thought was quite quirky and cute. Only $15 as well. Feels quite good quality. And they've got some Wiggles Christmas stuff, some of the Paw Patrol, Spider-Man. Really cool. So they have Christmas teas, Mr. and Mrs. Claus for $10, but there's also a bunch of other ones. Really nice if you've got like a work event or you need to wear like a Christmas shirt for work. This is awesome. Or even just Christmas day if you want to go a bit more cash. These pants are adorable for little girls. They have a shine about them, they're all glittery. If you're going for more of a subtle, chic Christmas vibe, these are definitely the vibe that I would go with. They've also got some really nice sparkly shirts. They also have some really nice linen pieces in for girls too, just as a side note. And then these like dotty linen pants. Oh, so cute. I absolutely love Best and Less's Disney stuff. We've got some of their Lion King stuff at home that our sister-in-law kindly got us for the boys. But I just saw this one and I kind of want to get it. <laughs> so cute. It's only $12, which I think is reasonable considering the quality. They have some really cute boy rompers and boy sets. So it's got this really nice reindeer one with the pants and the straps. They've got some reindeer nice t-shirts. I'm thinking of getting Winnie this one which is a white with gingerbreads to go with Darcy's big gingerbreads. Give you the little one. Yeah. They've also got this grey version which has the reindeer with antlers and a greyer um, short. These are actually more like jeans. And then they've got a Santa version. My first Christmas. Singlet. A pajama set which has the same gingerbreads as before. It's only ten dollars for this set. I'm tempted to get this for Winnie. came across this, which 
which is obviously again aprons, but it's got little fluff on the top and the bottom. It was only I think 12, oh, 10 dollars. So I might have to come back for that, but I'm thinking I'm gonna check out the reject shop first. But anyway, let's go check out and I'll show you what I got. So I'm now back home and I've taken off my makeup. So I do apologize if I look a little bit different. I am about to show you what I got from Best and Less. Let me tell you, first of all, before we get into the haul, that I was very disappointed with the women's range. I know that it was cheap and I wasn't expecting great quality from it, but I was expecting Kmart quality um, for the price of it. So I was a little bit disappointed. The shape of things just didn't look right. And yeah, I can't say I suggest the women's range. So if you're looking at maybe trying those out send me a message if you get some because i'd love to i'd love to see what they look like on actual people rather than the ads um but anyway let's get on with the haul i mostly got things that are for winnie um and then i got a couple of bits for christmas as well so the total of my haul came to 51 dollars the first item that i bought which i think is just adorable and also um gender neutral are these little dungaree shorts just absolutely adorable there is only one pocket on the back though i wish that it had two i don't know why but i just feel like that looks a little bit tacky but hey ho it doesn't matter he's going to be sitting on his bum while he fits this anyway because the size that i got is six to twelve months so he'll be crawling a little bit but he'll be sitting on his bottom a lot it was twenty dollars and yeah just really nice it's got the proper working uh, clasp or hook whatever you want to call it uh, it has a little bit of a smell like cheap denim but I'm gonna soak it and um, give a couple of washes a couple of washes before I let him wear it so I had to get that and then the next item I've seen these everywhere on Instagram but I wanted to um, go in store and have a look before I decided to purchase it online or anything like that it was only five dollars which I thought was pretty remarkable this waffle uh, what you call it like onesie suit thingy what do they call it they don't have a name on it that's that's handy um it's kind of like a jumpsuit onesie thing so it has little clips at the bottom that you can obviously change the nappy with i love the burnt orange sort of tangerine color really really nice it's actually really nice quality as well like it's not very see-through at all like it might be able to see slightly when i'm pulling but if i'm not pulling it's very very nice and thick and luxurious i would say that this would be 20 dollars, but it was only five dollars which i was really amazed with i ended up getting the size three to six months because they didn't have any sizes bigger um in the current store that i was in i'm not sure if that's the same for everywhere but they only had three to six and then it's got a couple of buttons at the back to help fit it over the head. So yeah, I really liked that. I also thought it was quite generously sized in this particular one. I know that in the store I said that Baby Berry tends to run a little bit small, but in this particular one, I didn't I didn't think so. I must say too that it's been a few years since I've bought the Baby Berry brand, so they might have adjusted their sizing, but last time that I bought from them, which was a couple of years ago, I had to go up in size. Now, next item that I bought was that really cute sloth onesie onesie what are these called you guys are gonna tell me <laughs> tell me in the comments what this is called because i cannot for the life of me think of what it is um but anyway it does up at the bottom and it's this beautiful mustardy yellow color again feels really good quality for four dollars i was absolutely gobsmacked and i got it in size six to twelve months just love it absolutely love it so i will be definitely buying more basics from best and less in the future so this was the boys christmas um shirts for the day i'm not sure if they're going to wear it on actual christmas day or if it'll be like for family christmas because we're doing pre-christmas and post-christmas with both sides of the family so um, i'm not sure if this will be more for that or actual christmas day with us but this is winnie's it is this gorgeous little white button-up shirt with little gingerbread men i thought it was adorable it was only 12 dollars, i think 10 dollars, even better um so yeah i thought it was really nice it's not the thickest like it, you will be able to see slightly through but um it's not it's not by any means thin 
and for the price again really reasonable quality and um structure and shape and everything like that and it also has like that proper line across the top so it's thicker up the top than it is on the rest of it really impressed with that and then because i wanted the boys to semi match i got darcy the bigger gingerbread men on a black so it's kind of matching but not really too matchy matchy so they'll be different but sort of the same and they also didn't do this one in a smaller size and they didn't do this one in a bigger size so it kind of had to be this way, but I kind of really like it like this anyway. They're unique, but it's also matching. That is all I ended up buying from Best and Less, but I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what was in the store for Christmas. Hop in there if you're interested. This video is not sponsored at all, but if you guys wanna let me know what you get from Best and Less, make sure to tag me over on Instagram if you put a post up or leave me down in the comments your favorite bit from today. Also, I would really appreciate your opinions or suggestions on future shop with me. So if you could leave those down in the comments as well, I would greatly appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe as well, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. What does perfect even mean?